So today uh, we've got a couple of operations ongoing, a couple of visits. Uh, the first one is here, which is uh, Residential Street, Allen Road in Northampton, uh, on the outskirts of the town. And we're here because we've, we've had intelligence that there may be a brothel running out of one of the terraced houses. Uh, we've been allowed in willingly because it is a safeguarding visit at the end of the day. Uh, and uh, we found in there three Romanian females and two Romanian males. We've got one female on her own here. She looks quite young, so we'll just double check that her welfare and we'll probably do that through language line at the moment because uh, I don't think her English is suitable for having a conversation. We want to be comfortable that what she's telling us is going to be um, good accurate information at the end of the day. Um, initially um, they've not disclosed that they're sex working however all the evidence around the house suggests that sex working was going on and after they gained our trust a little bit they did open up to say that they were sex working. Uh, we've given them lots of opportunity to actually say that they're, uh, whether they're at risk or not. Um, they haven't identified they're at risk. I have my reservations about that, but we have tried to encourage them to sort of safeguard themselves and, and if necessary they can come out with us and we will safeguard them. We will probably look to revisit this address at some time in the near future just to ensure that the same girls are here, uh, that everything is still as it was, as in they're still uh, happy that they're in control of their own circumstances or um, if there's other girls that are here, um, different girls, then that would raise my concern again that we're getting some sort of revolving door. Uh, we've also been at a car wash today. This is a, a, a fairly new car wash. They're, they're obviously quite common and I'm sure lots of people use them but they probably don't understand that the workers may be being exploited at these car washes. We're just checking out to see who's working there, who's in control of it uh, and whether there's any concerns. What you normally see with car washes, you get young uh, foreign national males that come over, they may be vulnerable, um, uh, they may even be homeless, they come over here to, in order to get a better life and do some work, but they're then being exploited in the car washes. They may be working long hours, seven days a week, uh, no contract and for uh, a few pound a day um, and very poor accommodation. 